What's up guys, I'm Ben from Authent Tech and huge thank you, I'm super honored and blessed we just blew through 200,000 subscribers. That's seriously such a huge number and I'm seriously just honored. I remember just like yesterday when I was super small, I couldn't even imagine hitting 100,000. We just doubled it and who knows what the future holds. Also super cool, since we just hit 200K a few days ago, we're already at 2300 plus in just a few days. That is so awesome. So thank you, thank you, thank you to all of you guys who have ever clicked that subscribe button and maybe even that bell notifications. I'm super grateful. I'm also super thankful to any and all brands and companies who have ever sent me a product to review or maybe a sponsorship. It's helped feed my family and helped grow this channel over the years. Also, huge shout out to Danny from Space City Drones for sending his FPV racing quad right through that 200k gingerbread house. In today's little update video, I wanted to bring you guys behind the scenes of what's coming up in 2019, uh, Q&A episode 3, and a little surprise at the end. So happy new year to you all, 2019. Just next week, I'm flying over to Vegas for CES. If you see me, come over and say hello. It'd be awesome to meet you. I have a few fun videos planned for while I'm over there. And then as this channel continues to grow, I have a lot more bigger and more fun, exciting projects, video ideas, and even some giveaways. So this is gonna be Q&A episode three. I asked you guys on my Instagram, Twitter, and my YouTube community tab to send in your questions. Make sure you guys are following me on my Instagram in case you haven't already. Thank you all for submitting your questions. Let's jump right in. Kyle asks, what made you want to start a YouTube channel? So I've always been into making videos. That's why I studied in college and really into tech and gadgets. I used to buy gear all the time for my video business. And then if I saw there weren't good reviews out there, I would just make it for fun. Well, then I made that hoverboard video. It blew up. I saw the massive potential of YouTube. So then I'm able to mix the two worlds perfectly together. I love making videos and then I love reviewing, playing with, and testing different tech gadgets, camera gear, all that sorts of stuff. C Jog asks, any plans on doing a comparison on the Osmo Pocket versus Osmo Plus? Um, they never sent me the Osmo Pocket, so not sure if that comparison is coming soon, but stay tuned. And thank you guys for always sending your video ideas and suggestions. I'm always listening, and if I have time, I try to make that video for you guys when I can. Clickbait GT, how much is all of your tech worth, like RC car, phone, and all that cool stuff? I try to sell a lot of my old stuff, so not including that, maybe 10, 15K, it's just a rough guess. Yasin asks, how long have you been on YouTube? Okay, so I'm not sure to find out, I go find my hoverboard video which is what kicked it all off we're at 15 million views on that sucker that is so awesome thank you thank you that was published on june 11th 2015 so we're about three and a half years going full-time on youtube oh he also asked how do i get subscribers i'm sitting at 36 um i just say keep creating content it's hard grind it's a lot of hard work there's a lot of competition especially on youtube right now but just keep producing content and all it takes is one video to really get recognized. Sreeky, which is the best GoPro, Hero 6 and Hero 7? Definitely the new 7 Black is my top favorite right now. It's very, very good. Raven, don't you think sports cams are overpriced, especially GoPro? Um, I do think GoPro buffers in a little bit of extra margin on there, especially since the Yi and a few others are really able to undercut it. Definitely shop it around if you're not needing the name brand GoPro best of the best. There's a lot of good options out there. Yanny Swanny, hey, I was just wondering if you're doing a giveaway soon, maybe a phone. Or um, a phone giveaway would be awesome. I don't get a ton of those around, but maybe in the future, the larger we grow, I'd love to be able to do some phone giveaways. All right, that's it for Instagram. Jumping to my YouTube community tab. We got 15 comments here. Ramesh, from which country do you have high subscribers? Let's jump into my analytics and double check. My top country for subscribers is United States and then India in second place. Shout out to you guys from India. Peter says, if on a budget, would you buy an action camera like a Yi 4K or go camcorder like an Okay, so definitely the Yi, that's an action camera. You're gonna have infinity focus, it's ultra wide angle. I wouldn't be doing any zoom on that. 
Zahid asks, what's your favorite rideable? I have a lot and I'm always changing and going through them. I'm really liking my King Song uh, electric unicycle right now. And then also my cycle board, but stay tuned. They have a Rover off-roading front and rear suspension model coming soon. Hopefully I'll be getting my hands on that very, very soon. What is your favorite iPhone? What's your favorite Samsung phone? What's your favorite phone? Aiden's life. Uh, I'm currently rocking the iPhone XS, Shh, don't tell anyone, but I'm really looking forward to that Samsung S10, hopefully dropping in the next month or two. Rocket Man asks, what camera do you film on and how do you edit your videos? Maybe an idea for a future video, that'd be awesome. I'm using the Sony FDR AX100 right now. I edit everything on my iMac 5K in Final Cut Pro. And then yes, if there's enough interest out there, I'd love to do a behind the scenes workflow editing sort of video down the road. Ashley, David, are you aware of the new drones coming out with different company? Um, I don't know of anything new coming out. And if I did, usually they make you sign an NDA. So you're not really allowed to talk about it. Wheel Adventures, which phone do you like? Um, I'm actually switched back to the iPhone 10 as just because that camera, that HDR 4K 60, it looks so good. The autofocus and colors just straight out a camera it works really well for some of my quick and dirty b-roll shots Saket, when will you restart reviewing rc toys especially cars i am going to try get back into some of those rc cars and those fun toys like that so make sure you stay tuned and i'll try to ask for giveaways when i can sar what do you like to do other than making youtube videos um i really like spike ball but haven't played in a while I love to grab a scooter and go ride down at the lake or downtown. And I like to play a little bit of video games when I can. Rainbow Six Siege on PC is my current favorite. And number two, please make video on Osmo Pocket. Again, I'd love to. I'd love to compare it to the GoPro and other cameras. I'm just waiting for them to maybe send me one. Dutch Drone, do you travel a lot? And with what drones are you making shots? I actually don't travel very much. I like to stay home with the family. And it actually depends on which drone I use, depending on the shot, the scenario, location, all that stuff. Stuff. Nick Downer asks, which of all your scooters do you ride the most? Again, I'm really liking the electric unicycle and the cycle board. Okay, and that's it with Q&A episode three. Again, thank you all for sending in your questions. Thank you, thank you. Now, last big update, channel memberships are coming soon. Very, very soon. I'm in the works actually with YouTube of releasing on the beta program of multiple tiers in channel memberships. It's very cool. So just like Patreon, you can get access to exclusive perks for small monthly donations. I'm trying to create a few small low-end tiers so it's just a couple bucks a month if you really appreciate what I'm doing and want to see more videos and then also hopefully a few higher end tiers for some really cool exclusive perks. So stay tuned for that. That should be coming very soon. I should make a whole different video when that launches and if you have any suggestions or requests leave them down in the comments for those memberships. I'm thinking about community updates, extra maybe behind the scenes videos or live streams, maybe a live Q&A chat maybe even some promo discount codes for certain products. Let me know what your thoughts are down in the comments. Massive, massive thanks to all of you guys for subscribing. I really, really thank you. So happy 2019 New Year to you all. I'm really excited for what this new year might hold. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and stick around for more tech videos posted every week. Thank you guys, and together, let's live authentic.